Hello guys, so welcome to KO Tutorials. So let's continue with the next part of this tutorial. So let's get started. So as you can see over here, we have started with the unwrapping of this particular four like character. So let's go into the UVs over here. So as you can see, I have unwrapped this four legs over here. So now what I'll be doing over here will be unwrapping the body part. So let's get started. So now as you can see, I'll just go over here. First let me check where is the cut. So this is the cut over here as we have assigned this. Alright. So let's take a edge. So before we go into this, let me select the polygons over here. So I'll just select this polygons, this part, excluding this part, excluding this part and also excluding the tail. So I'll just exclude this over here right away. So let's just select this stuff. So that's totally okay. So whatever area you don't need it, we'll just exclude that for now. After that, once it is selected, I'll just go into this UV over here and I'll go into the planner, go into the Y axis and I'll just click on the project over here in this way. So once you assign a project, now let's go into this. Let's select this edges over here. So I'll just go into this. I'll just slightly push this out. Let's select the edges, select this edges, select this edges and over here uh, first we'll just check this from where it is. So I'll just select this, I'll go into this. Okay, till here. So same way, till there. So select this edges over here. So till here I'll just make sure I'll select all these edges at the bottom. So I'll just go over here till here, go back till here. All right. So once your edges are selected in this way, as you can see, I have uh, assigned this edges over here. So let's go into this. UV editor and I'll go into this and I'll just give a cut also I'll again select this part and you can also go into this UV editor and let's give a cut over here so select this polygons go into modify and let's unfold it so as you can see I have unfold this particular area for the back side. So that's a total body unfolding I have done. Now again I'll select this particular tail over here. So let's go over here, select this, control, 
shift i so i'll press control shift i for inverse selection let's go into uv let's give a planar mapping in this way so i'll select this uv editor and let's give cut over here so we have already separated this so let's select this stuff in this way all right so again go into the uv editor and let's again give a cut over here so i'll just pull this out go into modify and i'll just unfold this so as you can see over here i have unfold this uh, tail part so tail part is unfolded over here so So let's select this face part. I'll just save this over here. So as you can see over here, so this particular part, oops, okay. Uh, so this part. we need to select it you can just go into this and let's give a cut again select this and again unfold it now that's the correct way to unfold this part so now we can see over here we have unfolded this whole body over here so i can just push this section over here so if you want to join you can easily join this if if you require to join this elements you can easily just join this elements so i'll just go over here i can slightly push this over here so i'll select this let's exclude this and you can just see this if required so the same way i can just go over here slightly rotate it i'll just subtract this all over here let's subtract this all right so once you're done you can just go into this and let's see this right away so again you can select this faces and again you can unfold this so now it is correctly unfold so i'll go over here i'll just scale this over here so slightly i'll rotate it if required so as you can see over here if you want you can just see this that's totally okay or if you want to keep it aside you can just keep it aside or else you can just go over here and you can just cut this out you can just cut this you can split it then again i'll go into this 
go into the UV shell again let's unfold it so you can just easily unfold this stuff and you can just go over here push this over here so I can just subtract this wherever it is required and you can just sew this let's sew this stuff the same way I can again go over here and let's give a cut over here so again go into the UV shell and let's unfold it again again push this over here I'll slightly scale this I'll rotate it push it over here so I'll just select this I'll deselect this stuff over here and now again you can just sew this you can just sew the stuff so again go into this and let's give unfold okay I think there uh, is some problem with this oh, okay I'll subtract all of this let's just check this out where this part exactly is oops ok so the loops which you have selected is just offset that's totally ok you have just offset this part so that's the reason So you can and if you want you can just subtract this and let's see this so you can go into the tools also and you can try to make it smoother oops unfold it ok yeah so now it's correctly unfolded so this is your tail part let's see how it looks like after you your unfolding is done so as you can see over here we have done this again select this stuff so now you can see your legs and the tail both are unfolded I'll go into this and lay out along with this part so we have unfolded this part over here so guys if any doubts please put it in the comment section over here so please like and subscribe my youtube channel so I'll, I can just add a checker if required so I can just go into this assign new material I'll go into the Lambert
so let's go into this Lambert and I'll just assign a checker over here so I'll go into the checker and I'll set it as 10 by 10 so again if you go into this check the checker material attributes make it as 20 by 20 go into UV editor and off this so now as you can see how a checker is functioning over here so we have uh, almost done with the unfolding of this or you can say the unwrapping of this particular character so the face part is left so face part will be covering it up in the coming tutorial so as you can see the checkers are correctly fitting even you can use this if you want so guys if any doubts please put it in the comment section over here so please like and subscribe my youtube channel so thanks for watching this tutorial